Alright, <clears throat> so now that we're in the game, I'm gonna show you guys about what 150 hours worth of playing will kind of get you. I don't know, it's where it got me. I probably just fucking suck at the game. Um, so here's here's the big reveal. Um, I'll do a flyover. So what we got? Got myself a Bronto. Giant ass doors. Uh... Got myself a nice little house. Fabricator. Smithy. If you guys don't know what this if you guys don't know what this stuff is, then I don't know how to describe it. Build shit. That's all I know. Refining forge. Shit ton of metal in it. A lot of resources. Gas grills. Beds galore, so I can always spawn here. Freezers. Out here. Uh, yeah, fuck it, I'll show you that later. Got a nice little water pen. Uh, have a beautiful farm going. It looks like shit, but you know, it's beautiful to me. Got my three dolphins and my two megalodons. Um, I'm gonna take a bird and I'll be right back. Alright, so from an aerial view on my house, uh, as you can see there's three generators on top of my house, which powers Terrence's house. You guys don't know him yet, but you'll probably see him in one of my ARC videos that will come up after this. I, I didn't really want to make too many videos on ARC before I did my goal, so I reached my goal of uh, over 100 hours and now that I've done that, I'm going to make some videos a little bit more on this game. Um, so I have power going to his house. I also have power going over to John's house. You guys all know John. Um, and then I made another generator way over there for Nick. It's a separate generator. He can run his own stuff. It's right there. Um, so I don't know what to tell you guys. Uh, you can pretty much see everything. I mean, you guys probably want to know the levels of stuff, but I'm too ashamed of their levels to show anybody. I got a Rex, Spino, two Carnos, a lot of different Pterodons, Sabres, Raptors, Scorpion, pretty much everything. This is about what um, 150 hours worth of gameplay looks like. You got f oh shit, I can't see it now. Go back down, please. Down. Down. Anyway, so this is what a, a, approximately 150 hours worth of gameplay looks like. Um, four different houses. Um, pretty much, I guess mine's the biggest out of everyone's. Um, the dimensions for my house are the same as Terrence's, except mine's taller, and um, I have much, a much bigger pen, ocean-wise, than anybody. No one else has one. No one wanted to build into the ocean. I'm crooked. I don't know why. I'm, t I'm like falling over my chair, sleeping. And there's an annoying ass squeak. Um, yeah, so we are, if anyone wants to know, by the blue obelisk, uh, east zone one, I believe, when you spawn in. Um, pretty much the safest place on the island, I want to say. Um, I've only seen a couple Carnos and hardly ever any raptors out here where we are. But uh, there are a couple of raptors every now and then. But besides that, there's nothing really over here that wants to kill you besides dillos. And dillos are easy. Uh, you don't start seeing anything s super scary until you're past that obelisk.
I guess I pissed off an Ankylosaur. <sighs> God damn it. And I'm dead. He's still pissed. Mega Pranas are OP. Was not worth my time. Mm -mm. All right. Well, now that I finally got the supply crate, and that I'm finally, you know, near death again, I suck. My lecture. My electric wires. What the fuck? His arm is broken. That's not okay. I haven't seen an arm that broken since Harry Potter. I'm talking about the first one. That was some messed up shit. I'm running out of things to say in this video. I should probably wrap it up with something better than that. But, uh, I got nothing, so. Again, see you guys on the next video.